Hi, Chanel here from Tips and Tricks HQ and in this short tutorial, we'll look at the checkout process for your customers if you're using the Stripe Payments plugin on your WordPress website to sell goods and services. On my test website, I've gone ahead and I've installed and activated the Stripe Payments plugin and that I've set up my Stripe Payments plugin using my API keys that are found in my Stripe dashboard. So once you've gone ahead and you've set up all the required settings, you can view our other video on how you can do that. Then you'll create your very own product or your service that you'll be selling to your customers. So as you can see, I'll be selling high definition wildlife images to my customers and they'll cost $1.95 for them to buy. So then if a customer comes to this page, I've created my product and I've entered the short code for that product on the page, they'll be able to see it and they'll be able to click the buy now button to purchase that item if they wish to. If it's a digital item, after they've paid, they'll see the option to download that item. Whereas if it's a physical, you'll need to collect their address, which they'll need to enter, and then you'll need to ship out the item to them. So basically, if I'm a customer and I land on this page and I wish to buy the wallpaper image, I read some of the text, I see the thumbnail image and think, yep, this looks perfect, I can click that buy now button. So once I click that buy now button, I'll see the stripe pop up. I need to enter my name, my email, and my credit or debit card details. So for this transaction, I'll just be using a test card visa. Although in real life, it's a similar process for your customers when they're doing a live transaction. So once I've entered in all my card details, my name and my email, I can click that pay button to complete the payment. If it's successful at this stage, I'll be then directed to the checkouts results page or a thank you page. So there you can see, I've been now directed to the checkout results page where I can see what I've purchased and I can download my digital content. So if I click there, that allows me to download that image straight away. So that basically concludes the checkout for your customer. If you have any questions or queries about how the checkout process works or how it will work on your site, please feel free to comment them below.